Hi, it is 7 o'clock in the morning. You're watching Pep Talk India's YouTube channel. I'm Rocky Sagu. We have video genius with us, Jordan. Hi from his side. And guess what? We have an expert. She has transformed many lives. She has trained thousands of people. She's going to tell you how to answer the most dreadful question of this planet. Tell me about yourself. Let's not waste time and go straight to her. Hi, Kushi. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Fantastic. How about you? I am fantastic. So what did you have in breakfast? Not parathas. Not parathas. Point to be noted. Kushi Singh didn't have parathas in the morning. So you must have a lot of butter on parathas. Lot of butter. You know Punjabi moms lap with the makhan pa. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. So how to answer? Tell me about yourself. Um, see, first of all, one has to understand why is this question asked in most of the interviews. Whether you're fresher or you know experienced doesn't really matter. Now this question serves two different purposes. The first purpose of asking this question is to know do you have presentation skills? Mm -hmm. Do you know how to present yourself? The first thing. So they this, want to know about our presentation skills. Exactly. And the second important thing, they wish to know that what is the most important thing which you wish to highlight about your background? Mm -hmm. Which generally people mess up by talking about their family background and the rest of the other things. Yeah, I remember one incident. One student, as she was asked about the family background and she said, I have 14 brothers and sisters. Point to be <laughs> noted again. <laughs> 14 real brothers and sisters. I told her not to say this in interview. So see, because I learned from you only. Right. <laughs> you see, people mess it up just because they listen to different answers. Mm -hmm. Instead of preparing their own answer, they have the ready-made format. They just go and speak about it. In most of the today's uh, multinational company, they are not even bothered to know about your family background and other things. They wish to know who you are and what you're going to contribute to the company, mm -hmm. right? So, um, in order to answer this question, I'm going to tell you the format. Format. And yes. in fact, to these guys. That's going to be really helpful. Right. So the first thing you should talk about in this question is your professional identity mm -hmm. now when I say professional identity I mean who you are as mm -hmm. a professional how do people know you in corporate and how should people know you in corporate mm -hmm. your name and your enriched experience by mm -hmm. now second thing would be the achievements what all achievements you carry on your sleeves in today's date I mean you have you have you been um, given any trophy any award reward from the company in the previous company or have you even been recognized untitled leader mm -hmm. do talk about that mm -hmm. and third most important thing would mm -hmm. be how would you be an asset to the company where you are going to get, uh, you know? That has to join. be the most important thing. Absolutely. And how we can be an asset for the company. A absolutely. People talk about uh, that I had the habit of uh, collecting stamps. <laughs> I like listening to the music. What on earth company will do even if you're a fantastic singer and you're going to be the coder there? <laughs> right? So, Point to be noted. <laughs> So the, so the three things one should remember while structuring the answer for this question, your professional identity, second your achievements and third, how would you be an asset to this company? Wow, wow, very helpful, very informative. So um, you know what, once I was talking to one of the students in the mm -hmm. session and student told me something about you. Oh my God. <laughs> student, one of the students said uh -huh. that Sir was talking once that how was and how horrifying my first interview experience was. Would you like to talk about that to these people? Yeah, yeah it was a disaster. It was a disaster. I was all set, went for interview. The moment I saw a beautiful girl is going to interview me, my God, <laughs> I ran away. I ran away like anything. Seriously? Because yes. you were not prepared or what? Just the beautiful girl? Ah, the, the fear of beautiful girls. Fear of beautiful girls. You see, the world is scared of beautiful girls. But it's not over yet. It's not over yet. Kushi Singh is going to tell. Tell me about yourself, sell yourself, walk me through your resume, how to answer all these questions. Stay tuned, stick around, we are coming right away. Hi, welcome back. We have just had fantastic coffee. We still have talented Kushi Singh with us. There is one confusion. 
What is the difference among? Tell me about yourself, sell yourself, and walk me through your resume. Well, the first difference is in the structuring of the sentence. <laughs> uh, so, okay, jokes apart. When you ask, tell me something about yourself, something about yourself, not everything about yourself. <laughs> Point to be noted. Then when you ask the question, uh, sell yourself. See, you do have the strongest selling point as a candidate. So just talk about the strongest selling point of yours, means your strongest area mm -hmm. as a professional. Mm -hmm. And the third thing, when you ask the question, tell me, uh, walk me through your resume. See, um, resume or CV is something which they already have. They want you to highlight only those points or only those sentences or the things which you want the interviewer to remember, nothing else. So in a nutshell, you have to be an asset for the company, especially during the interview. Yeah, absolutely. See, but um, if you look deeper into it, in all the questions, your job is to sell yourself. Your job is to create the 30 second, first 30 second great impression. And that impression can be created only when you are well prepared in advance. Stop cramming up others' answer, others' format. You create your own answer and thrive as the best candidate in your next interview, of course. Well, why don't you ask your viewer to join me in the master session at Pep Talk India? Of course, of course. So if you wish to join that amazing session of Talented Kushi Singh, Pep Talk India is the destination. So you wanted to know and you have got to know how to answer. Tell me about yourself. Do check the link in the description below if you wish to know the detailed article. And keep watching Pep Talk India's YouTube channel. We'll be back again. Ta-da! Don't forget to subscribe this channel. This is amazing channel.